Today, we're diving into open source software, or OSS. We'll explore how publicly available source code can be freely used, modified, and shared, and discuss the benefits like open collaboration, flexibility, lower costs, and community support, along with some challenges like managing dependencies and licenses. Open source software means the source code is publicly available, allowing anyone to use, modify, and share it. This transparency fosters collaboration and continuous improvement by a global community of developers. Key principles include open collaboration. Anyone can contribute by submitting code changes, bug fixes, or new features. Free distribution. OSS can be freely distributed, copied, and used without licensing fees. Access to source code. Users can inspect, modify, and learn from the code. Community-driven development. A vibrant community collaborates, provides feedback, and drives the software's evolution. OSS has been widely adopted in various domains, such as operating systems, web browsers, office suites, source code managers, and programming languages. Many companies and individuals benefit from OSS, promoting innovation, cost-effectiveness, and knowledge sharing. The development process of OSS is a collaborative effort involving a global community. Unlike proprietary software where the source code is kept secret, OSS projects make their code openly available. This allows developers worldwide to contribute their skills and ideas, improving the software. Open source projects typically have a core team of maintainers who oversee the project's direction, review code contributions, and ensure adherence to coding standards. Open discussion within the community allows users and developers to provide feedback, report issues, and share ideas for future development. The power of OSS lies in leveraging the collective intelligence and diverse perspectives of contributors. This collaborative approach allows OSS projects to evolve rapidly, adapt to changing needs, and produce high-quality software that benefits users globally. OSS offers many advantages, flexibility and customization. Users can modify the code to meet their specific needs, adding new features, optimizing performance, or enhancing security. This freedom ensures the software can be tailored to unique requirements. Cost savings. OSS provides significant cost savings compared to proprietary software. With no licensing fees or expensive maintenance contracts, OSS is a cost-effective option, especially for organizations with limited budgets. Interoperability and compatibility. OSS often uses open standards and protocols, facilitating seamless integration and data exchange across different environments. This avoids vendor lock-in and enhances flexibility in the technology stack. Community support. OSS fosters a vibrant community of individuals who collaborate, share knowledge, and contribute to the collective advancement of software development. This community-driven approach promotes transparency, learning, and innovation. While OSS has many benefits, it also presents challenges. Support and maintenance. OSS projects often rely on voluntary efforts, leading to inconsistent or delayed support, especially for niche projects with smaller communities. Managing contributions. Coordinating contributions from a diverse global community can be complex. Effective governance and quality control are crucial to maintain a cohesive codebase. Security. The open nature of OSS exposes it to potential vulnerabilities. Projects must prioritize security audits, prompt patching, and proactive measures to safeguard against threats. Documentation. OSS can sometimes lack comprehensive documentation, making it challenging for users with limited technical expertise to effectively use and troubleshoot the software. Licensing and compliance. Ensuring code contributions adhere to the project's licensing terms and do not infringe on third-party intellectual property rights is crucial to avoid legal disputes. OSS and closed-source software represent two different approaches. Open source. The source code is available for anyone to inspect, modify, and distribute. This fosters a collaborative development model and peer review for quality assurance and security. Closed source. The source code is proprietary and kept secret. Users are granted a license to use the software, but cannot modify or redistribute code. Development process. 
OSS is driven by a global community where closed source software is typically developed by a dedicated team within a company. Licensing models. OSS uses licensing like GNU, GPL, or MIT to encourage free distribution and modification. Closed source software uses proprietary licenses that restrict modification and redistribution. Interoperability. OSS prioritizes open standards and interoperability, while closed source software may prioritize vendor lock-in strategies. Philosophy. OSS promotes transparency, collaboration, and freedom, while closed source models often prioritize commercial interests and intellectual property protection. The Open Source Initiative, OSI, is a globally recognized nonprofit organization promoting and advocating for OSS. Founded in 1998, the OSI plays a pivotal role in defining open source principles through the open source definition, ensuring that open source projects adhere to principles of free distribution, access to source code, derived works, and non-discriminatory license. The OSI also maintains a list of open source licenses and advocates for the adoption of OSS across various sectors. By providing resources, guidance, and support, the OSI empowers individuals, organizations, and communities to embrace open source practices and navigate the complexities of licensing and governance. In conclusion, open source software offers significant benefits like flexibility, cost savings, and community support, while also presenting challenges like support and security management. By understanding the principles and benefits of OSS, Organizations can leverage its potential to drive innovation and stay competitive in the evolving technological landscape. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more insights on optimizing your software development practices.